Here we have a wilderness made by Fleetwood also. His little sister to the Terry is what we got here, but a lot of nice features to it. Nice rock guard in the front. That's what you see all the way across there. Big 30 pound LP tanks on each side. Pass through storage. Landing gear all the way around. Four point landing gear all the way around on this unit. This is going to be in a bunkhouse. This notice, notice nice three steps going up and into the camper makes it easy on the littlest to the oldest. Easy loop axles. Look at those nice little grommets on there. A little bit bigger tire. There's your furnace. Serviceable unit makes a big difference. Look at look over here. We'll take a look over here and make sure we got a door open. The little things again, like your little your little uh, drip edges right there, that make a difference when you're when you're cleaning those hard to places where the water's running out and ain't got no place to go but the side of the camper so that way it, it kicks it out to the side of the camper makes it nice it's the little things but makes a difference a nice big bunk area on the side flips up what you can do right there in a situation like that you go to the side door you want those bicycles that you don't know what to do with put them on the inside of the camper and then when you get where you're going you can take them out take your bicycles out and then pull your, pull your lid down Look at the capacity on that, 350 pounds on anything. So it'll it'll hold your biggest boy to your littlest little, little son with comfort and assuredness that it's very sturdy. Nice big door on the bunk on that. Now this one is a manual awning, but it's a large awning. Speakers at the top on the outside speakers, so you can so you can listen to your music, enjoy your music. Nice big grab handle when you're walking in the interior of it. Uh, the particular model on this one, this is a 320 BHS, DBHS, with the Extreme Edition. Again, what you're looking at there is you're looking at something that is covered on the underbelly, so it'll make a difference. No little bugs crawling up underneath of there. Uh, keeps it cool in the summertime and keeps it a little bit warmer in the winter if you're going to go a little bit further in the season. This is features big. Uh, look how big, deep, nice and deep this slide is. Deeper slide. Always have windows to the side when you go to that size of slide, so it'll give you the most depth. Flex steel furniture on the inside, a lot like its big sister Terry. Pull out sofa is what you're going to be looking at underneath of there. So you'll be able to pull that out. Sleep two there, nice and comfortable. A little more hard surface counters. You got a little bit more substance to that. Um, nice, nice counters on the inside. Nice fixtures. Um, again, they're using a bigger one of the bigger one of your bigger ovens in the industry, along with your hood range, your microwave. Again, you're going along with about an eight to a ten cubic size refrigerator, nice size fridge, gas or electric, do either one. Ducted air all the way through, all the way through. Returns ducted makes a big difference when you're looking at campers. Again. I'm looking at that surround sound. I got that Jensen surround sound all the way around with that nice flat screen TV in the corner. Nice appointed. Nice to where you can view it anywhere, but again, it comes out on the arm. Move it where you want to. You can see what you want to. Go right over here to the head of it. You see the Jensen. It'll take your CDs, your DVDs, your DVRs. Got a nice big woofer behind here, too. Look at that. That'll give you the sound system that you want. No need to bring anything else with you. Ducted air through the back of the bedroom. It also has a stand for the television here. You've also got shades on this one. You got day. You can see. You can see the difference between the two. You got day and night shades on both of those. The wood's just really. You really have to look at the detail on this. It's beautiful. The woodwork on this. This is in a quad bunk. Also, in other words, this will have. This will have. When I say quad, I mean four bunks. You'll have two on each side one will be a little bit wider on this side a little narrow on that side but you got four for everybody and then you got the door for the exterior that you can get out on that side and load what you want to on the inside and yeah, bathroom wise look at that look at the size of the bathroom raised pedestal it's up on a raised pedestal on a foot flush fan tub shower overhead light Beautiful coach for the size. Nice sink on the outside, well appointed. Nice drawers, nice storage, storage under your booths. 
uh, your booth can break down it's on some really strong bolsters if you look at that see how that's made even the wood itself it's made per of a, what they call a, a material like a pergo it's about a good quarter of an eighth inch thick so you're coming in right out of the right out of from outside and right onto something that's not carpet or something easy to clean up for mom makes a big difference all your controls are right there by the panel when you're coming to the door nice coach nice coach then in, in our business this this is what they consider a, they consider a queen bed and if you notice that it's quilted in other words it has a nice pad on top of it look at that look at the size of the pad duck work everything everything makes a little bit of difference outlets that are in there you'll see outlets up underneath the, where your bureau or where you're going to put your clothes you just couldn't ask for a nicer bunkhouse if you're looking for something in a bunk need a three-quarter ton truck to say something like this but it'll do a nice job even the screen door if you notice the screen door notice the construction on there it's built in a little bit stronger it's not your normal screen door if you pull the screen door out you can do just a tape just on it in other words it doesn't flex it's got a little bit more stability to it really nice the model on that is a 320 dbhs it's a 2008 got a great price on it it's a closeout price on an 08 couldn't ask for more than that that's at paul sherry's come down and see us it's beautiful